Okay, so I can't start at the beginning, but here we are. This is the game. So this is your character. Your character is named Red. Excuse me. And your lover, Soul, is like trapped in your sword, essentially. So he will talk to you sometimes. And he sounds very tired and very sleepy. And he'll like try to talk to you like, you know, don't go in there. It's dangerous. Like he's always, it's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. Heartbreaking dialogue. Um, this little monitor following me around is another dude who, like, I think was evil and now isn't or something, but he'll talk to you. You'll notice there's a difference in voices, but that little computer thing is following me. I don't remember what I'm doing, but here we go. I don't remember. What are my abilities? Hold on. I'm going to figure them out first. Uh, I've got that one. I've got that one. I've got that one. I've got that one. I don't have my... Wait, what the fuck? Hold on. Hold up. So... As you go through the game, you get more and more abilities. Each time you see these access points, these are where you can swap out abilities in and out because you're obviously going to have a lot more than you can ever use. I don't know why I don't have a rush ability right now. Oh, well, let's just go in and see what the fuck I was doing. I haven't played for a while. It was from the brominated vegetable. <laughs> Yuck. See the little dude in the fucking monitor? It's creepy. Okay, we already did this. Just kidding. Not this way. <gasps> Hi, Mickey. How are you, love? I'm trying to show everyone the cool combat in <laughs> Transistor because I'm terrible at explaining it. I think there's combat. Oh, back door. These are kind of cool. So um, whenever you see a back door, giggity, you should enter it consensually. Um, it's basically like your little island of safe. Um, You have a dog. She likes us. That's like your lover's voice, soul, that's inside your sword that's heartbreaking. Well, you can kick a ball with your dog if you want. Like, this is just a safe place. Um, You can chill in a hammock. I think it saves the game. Dude, my neck's fucked up today, too. The fuck, Mickey? I woke up with such a sore neck. It's horrible. I can turn left. Like, it's not super stiff like it was a couple weeks ago, but it's the same muscle. It's so bad. Isn't that gorgeous? And you can just chill. And, um, ooh, I forgot. You can turn music on. So, like, as you go through the game, you unlock music for your little music player. So you can just, like, go through your music if you want. I like coasting. That's a ball. And that's a Luna. I believe all of those things, Fox, 100%. And then, so these are like little doors you can go in, and they're like tests. So if you want to test your powers, like test your abilities, test out different combos and shit, you can go through these doors and do like little tests and play with your shit. They're okay. They're all right. Some of them are really hard, though. Whoa, Trekkie. My 3BP meds didn't bring it down. So you know what I did? Red wine. I guess I'll have to drink. Did it work? Good for you. I don't condone taking, like, drinking alcohol, but as a solution. But I mean, Trekkie, bitch, if it worked. Get it. Back. I think there's a battle here. I think. This is something. Yeah. Yay. Okay. So, bad guys. I'll show you the pause in a minute. Sometimes the pause isn't the best solution, but give me a sec. Okay. Nope. That's the pause, but it's an ability. I'm telling you. It's an action. You got to watch it. Hold up. Okay. So these guys disappear and come back, but this is your pause ability. It is right trigger. And so now the bar on the top will be used up the more abilities I use on this dude. Does that make sense? But you can like take them away. If you don't like what you did. It's pretty fucking dope. It's so unique. I've never seen anyone do this before. It's kind of crazy. I'm, I'm digging it. And then it just does all that shit like rapid ass fire. <gasps> Bitches. Did I just kill them all? Oh, I killed two at a time? Bitch. Ooh, Suck it, haircut. Come here, you little bastard. I'm gonna touch you in your dirties. Come here. 
Come here. All right. I was trying to, I was hoping the man would come out, but whatever. Yeah, it's called just a man. Just a man. I killed one. And then I'm sure you guys saw those little white things. They like a little white guy with the little red face pops up. If you don't grab them fast enough, they'll respawn into bad guys. Where's the other dude? Oh, he's up here. Bitch, don't even try with me. There. Kind of cool, right? I leveled up. Yay. Dude, they always come out. And then you just get new abilities. And, like, I'll show you guys eventually how you can, like, you can make infinite combinations of these abilities. It's crazy. Um, I haven't played for a while, so let me look really quick. That's the leeching. And the little white tabs on them, that's how many, like, points they take up. You have a finite amount of points, obviously. Um, I'm going to take bounce. Bounce is really good. Bounce. Up, oh, bounce, bounce. Okay, you're almost here. Almost here. You ready? That's the creepy oh, guy. I'm beginning to get a little nervous. So come on now. Come on. You can tell the difference in the voices, right? <laughs> like creepy. So um, let me see. Let me. How do you get rid of them? Uh, remove or remove all of them, and then I'll show you what you mean. What I mean by combos. Each ability like does something different depending on where you put it on your bar, which is uh, it's. I know that sounds confusing. So let's put this one on the first. Your A. But then you can also, like, you see these spots on the side? These will be, like, passives. And any of the abilities could be a passive. They do something different. So if I put it in A, it's just, like, a base damage, like, whatever, hit. If I put it as a passive, it gives me immunity to slow and disable and user damage resist, which is pretty fucking dope. There's so many like this. Like, they're just, it's, there's so many possibilities. It's incredible. I have a really good time with this game because, like, you can just change shit forever. Um... Are there more velocity? I would like to do that one. And then I believe if you put them, yeah. So if you put, so this is jaunt. This is essentially like your, your rush. I said like run, I guess, or jump abilities. Just something to rush forward really quickly. You can use it as just a base ability and put it on your bar. And then it's, it transports the user to a nearby location. Cute. But if you put it as like an upgrade on an ability, it makes it so. <clears throat> So what happens is after you use that little freeze time ability, that has to recharge. And any of your damage abilities that you use during that recharge time are now not, you can't use any of them until the whole bar recharges. It's only a couple seconds, but it's enough time to just fucking die because you have no defenses, you have nothing to do. So if you put your little runner dude as a upgrade on any ability, it makes it so even if you use it during the pause time, you can use it outside of it while it's charging as well, which in my opinion is invaluable. Like that's... You must. You just die. I don't know how people do it without it. I just die all the time. There's another one. Sick. I don't know what I want to do, though. I have not played this game forever. Um, Let's see. That's the chaotic. Those are little bombs, aren't they? Launch, launch fast. Unstable shells. Yeah. I really haven't played in so long. I don't remember what anything is anymore. It's kind of cool. Uh, and by that, I mean I hate it. Um, crash will do daily, greater damage, or it will make me invisible. Give me stealth. Mm, I want to make it, like, there's some of these abilities look really cool. Like, you can throw people in the air and shit. That's all I'm trying to think about. What can I make look cool? Crash will deal more damage and send targets flying. Breach will deal more damage and send targets flying. That could be really fun. <laughs> That's going to be really fun. Breach is, like, your longest range, I think, of all, any of your abilities. Other than this one, ping's pretty long range, but it's, like, no damage at all, which is Shiza. Um, but you see the bar on the left, the M-E-M, -E the mem, that's your, like, points. That's your finite amount of abilities you can put on your bar. Um, let's see. Gain a deflecting shield, add a chain reactive effect. That would be fun. Chain reactions are fun. That's a packet. I don't like packets. I don't want your packet. Um, enhance most functions with lingering destructive effects. Apply a life-stealing effect to most functions. That one's okay, but I really don't feel like it's ever saved my ass. I never use it. Bitch, why? Split and 
subdivide spawn a copy on attacks no no Ooh, ricochet is good we just put ricochet on that one that's stupid katie stop it if we put it on this oh so when you use stealth you move a couple feet and this would put a trail of damage behind you if i put it on that mask will leave a damage trail in the user's wake for the effect of the duration sure fuck it let's try fuck it in the ass jesus that raises your life points Ooh. increase base damage output bitch oh <gasps> jeff so um hades hades pyre bastion and transistor are all made by the studio supergiant and Supergiant makes all of their own music in-house. So you'll see tons of crossover between all of the games. And literally, you'll hear the same voices, same people singing and stuff. Yeah. But that's why I'm allowed to play their music on my stream. Because they make it in-house. And I'm so happy about that. Thank you again very much. <laughs> Dearest. Stealth damage. Yeah. Okay, now I need passes. Um, Generate, vol generate volatile packets instantly at a regular interval. Recover, ooh, I could. I could have a zippy zip. And then I could leave poop packets. Maybe. Raise potency of most functions when backstabbing. No, no. Ugh, no. 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 Ooh. Wait. Oh. Bitch, what? Thanks, Ping. Um, no. Wait, what does it do in passive? Become undetectable and faster after limiting targets? No. Um, <laughs> see, now I don't have any points left, so now I gotta I can think about it. I don't like spawning a copy. I don't care about a fucking copy. Ooh. Yes. I have one point. What's a one pointer? Stealth? Is that it? No. Crash. What's crash do? Gain damage resistant, Im resistance and immunity to all slowing. Cosmos functions stun and disrupt, disrupt targets. Harm and fuck your mom. Um. Mm. <laughs> no, yeah, you know what? It's fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. <gasps> was this a progenitor to Hades? I didn't know that. I think I did play this before Hades, though. I beat Bastion before Hades. I don't think I beat this before Hades, though. Must be the place. I have beat this. I mean, Hi, Royce. you know, if beat you it. Hear me. Welcome. 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 Well, well, come, come in. Come, come on. Inside, inside my studio. studio. <laughs> I'm quite unarmed, as you can see. And, and it's safe, safe in here, relatively. Cheers. Safe. <laughs> Yeah, at least for now. <laughs> Here's the thing. Now, if the transistor doesn't go back in its cradle, then why, you and I both, well, we just won't be anything anymore in a little while. You, me, and the rest of this town. So, please, don't let my work go to waste. I'm being reasonable. Full disclosure, full disclosure here, which is, I am one, positively certain 100% that this will work, which is transistor plus cradle equals no more process. No funny business, okay? I love the dialogue. We'll just take it's it so one weird. thing at a time, one topic at a time. Cheers. Look, Wait, if, this was, if this was all just some kind of ruse on my part, I mean, how base? Why would I lead you all this way? I'll level with you. Yes, I would like it back. I'd very much, if you must know, but you know what? At this point, I would settle for not being wiped out of existence. I would happily settle for that. 
Okay, so now I'll wait. If you want me to wait, I'll wait. But the process, the process, as you can see, patience isn't one of its virtues. Always busy. Busy, busy, busy. Oh, Jeff, you're gonna get so high. I'm excited for that Whenever day for you. Whenever you're ready, which All right, shut I up. hope monitor. is going to be soon, <coughs> but I will say no more. Sure you won't. Creepo. I'm stuck. <gasps> Mr. Fox, have a wonderful sleep. I hope you have the most wonderful dress. Seriously, sleep well, drink water, brush your teeth. All the good things. Lower, please. Thank you. I can't use any of my abilities here, so I don't know what's going on. I don't remember this part. <coughs> Interesting. All right. All right. Ooh, iced coffee. Yum. I made myself a cup of coffee, but it's hot. It's hot, hot, hot. This is it then. This is it then. I don't remember what the cradle is. So he keeps talking about the process. The process is like what's destroying their city and making it look all digital and creepy. In case anyone wasn't, it, it does, hasn't played or whatever, but you should definitely play. There's The story is so deep and really, really well done. I love you. You know that, right? It's time. Bye for now. But I will see you again. I will see you again. I love you too, strange voice. I know you can hear me. I won't let you go. Stay with me. Stay with me. Okay, I may or may not have cried when I played this before, so I forgot this is the feels part. If I Let's cry see. again. The good news. Well, the process. I think we got it. Contained it. So the town is going to be all right. It's just, well, someone's going to have to rebuild. But we flew a little close to the flame there, so now we're here, not there. We're stuck. And unfortunately, the only way back that I'm aware of is, well, unpleasant. So let's get this over with. That guy creeps me out the side by that i was not expecting much wow really good movie world's end came out around the same time and i watched that movie which one was that one? Oh, that was the drinking one that's like one of my least favorite movies by simon pegg dude if you love it fucking love it i in no way believe in gatekeeping or like you know you know what i mean but for me specifically i was like okay it was okay but not my favorite What's the hot fuzz? I think hot fuzz is my favorite. But the greats are good. That one's so fucking funny. It just gets me. <laughs> Shaun of the Dead's really good too. I love Simon Pegg. Like, it's not a bad movie. It's just my least favorite, which is still saying it's probably my top, you know, 50 favorite movies in the world still. Cancel gatekeeping. I hate it. I hate when people are like, ew, you like that thing? Gross. You're gross. How could you like that? I don't like it. I don't even know how to do it. I, I'm not good at it. But it's a dumb. I mean, it's all entertainment. If it entertains you, great. If it doesn't entertain me, that doesn't mean it's a bad thing. Bad is subjective. Good and bad, you know. To the I can't remember what kind of battle this is. I think we might literally have to trial and error. I don't remember what kind of battle we're going to fight, though. Noble Crow! Bitch. First things first, thanks for the Bezos box. There's been so many prime resets today, I feel like it's worthy of stand up to grab my thong.
in honor.